to solve this kind of an equation we have to consider two cases the value of this expression will be either x minus 2 greater than 0 or x minus 2 less than 0 so for these two cases the solution also will be different so let us consider the first case when x minus 2 is greater than 0 so this equation will be reduced to x minus 2 whole square plus x minus 2 minus 2 is equals to 0 so if we break this with the help of the a minus b whole square formula this will become x square minus 2 into x into 2 square 2 plus 2 square plus x minus 2 minus 2 is equals to 0 so this will be x square minus 4x plus 4 plus x minus 4 is equals to 0 now this 4 and this minus 4 will be cancelled out so the expression will become x square minus 3x is equals to 0 now we can take x common and inside there will be an x minus 3 which will be equals to 0 now there are two solutions from this one is x is equals to 0 and another is x minus 3 is equals to 0 which implies the value of x is equals to 3 because this minus 3 will be in the right hand side now we have already considered that x minus 2 is greater than 0 which means x is greater than 2 so if x is greater than 2 then this is not an answer and this will be the answer and let us consider now the second case when x minus 2 is less than 0 then this equation will become minus x minus 2 whole square plus minus x minus 2 minus 2 is equals to 0 so this minus will be squared so it will become positive and this will become x square minus 2 into x into 2 plus 2 square but this minus will be multiplied with this plus and it will become minus and this will become x plus 2 minus 2 is equals to 0 so this plus 2 and minus 2 will be cancelled out and this will become x square minus 4x plus 4 minus x is equals to 0 which will become x square minus this minus 4x minus x this will become minus 5x plus 4 is equals to 0 now we can write this minus 5x as minus 4x minus x and here there will be x square and there will be 4 is equals to 0 we can take x common from the first two terms and inside the bracket will become x minus 4 and here we can take one common and inside there will be x minus 4 which will be equals to 0 so if we take common of x minus 4 inside there will be x minus 1 both will be equals to 0 so from here we can get x minus 4 is equals to 0 which implies x is equals to 4 and also x minus 1 is equals to 0 implies that x is equals to 1 now we have considered in this case that x minus 2 is less than 0 so this is not an answer and x is equals to 1 will be the answer so we are having two solution for x one is x minus 3 this one and another one will be x is equals to so we are having two solutions for x one is x is equals to 3 and another is x is equals to 1